Okay, another question, it's been sent by a group member. He has asked it how many concrete blocks can be molded using four cement bags. The ratio for concrete that is known, the block size is known, and the availability of cement that is actually four cement bags, okay? It is a very good question, but the data, that was not enough. This data is actually not enough to determine the quantity of blocks. You can say the number of blocks that we can mold, okay, using four cement bags. Okay, because we don't know about the, the block shape, okay, that's why I asked about the holes. If there is any hole in the same block, but he said, no, the block is completely solid, okay? He said, no hole, full closed block, okay? It means the block is solid and the you can say the size is known okay it is uh, six by nine inches and the length is 12 inches hey guys i'm suleiman khan and in this video we will be determining the number of blocks that we can mold or you can say that we can construct using only four cement bags so without wasting time let's move ahead toward the solution and in the solution as you can see the only thing that is known that is actually four bags or you can say the quantity of cement but I'm going to convert this into volume because these are bags, okay? So let me just multiply 4 with 1.25. Okay, 1.25 that is actually uh, the, the volume of one cement bag over here in Pakistan. You can use your country's bag volume if that is just different, okay? Where here we use 50 kg cement bag, okay? Which is of course 1.25 CFT or you can say cubic feet, okay? So 4 times that, that is actually 5 CFT. It means the quantity of cement that is known. Next, as you can see, the block size that is known, okay, which is 6 inches times 9 inches times 12 inches, okay. So let's multiply these three parameters. So we can get, of course, 0.375 CFT, or you can say cubic feet. Now, if you remember, we need the number of blocks. For that, I just need the quantity of concrete. Now, the quantity of concrete can be actually the concrete used in one block. And that is, of course, the block size times the number of blocks. And this is actually what I want, okay? The N, the alphabet N. That means the number of blocks. And this is actually our approach. So we can say the total concrete is now 0.375 N. Now let's focus on the given data, okay? The only thing we know is actually the cement. And that is 5 CFT or 4 bags. Now, you must be a little bit familiar with quantity serving and you must be familiar with this formula okay this is a simple formula many times okay it's been used uh, by me in the in you can say in many videos available on the same channel okay so we used to use this formula to determine the quantity of material now the only quantity that is actually the cement it is known okay so let's just determine the cement's quantity cement of course that is known the ratio of material that is actually one okay the ratio for concrete that is known one to four where there one means the ratio of cement two means the ratio of fine aggregate four means you can say that is represented for the or you can say labeled for the uh, you can say coarse aggregate so that's simple now one that means the ratio of cement so cement equals the ratio of material which is of course one we will divide that by the sum up ratio which is of course same one because one plus two plus four that's going to be same one. So one divided by same one. Now we will multiply this with the dry volume. Remember the dry volume can be the total concrete, which is of course that thing that's been determined few seconds ago, times a factor, which is of course 1.54. Now don't ask me what's 1.54 because a separate video is available on the same factor. Okay, how it comes and what it is. Okay, so here in this video, shortly you can say, in order to uh, convert or in order to determine the dry volume, we will multiply the wet volume with the same factor. Next, I'm going to simplify this thing a little bit more. Or you can say we can put the video for cement, which is of course 5 CFT. Now, 0.375 times 1.54 divided by 7, that can be of course 0.0825. Now, let's just divide both sides by 0.0825 so we can have the number of blocks or you can say the video for n okay alphabet n so n equals 60.6 blocks it means 60 concrete blocks can be molded with four cement bags and thank you for visiting the engineer boy